What's up guys, aka 7 Mouse here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to play DS, uh, Nintendo DS games on your Android device. Now, uh, before we start this, you know, this, this Nintendo DS emulator is actually in its early stages, but it has a lot of updates that keep on coming from the developer, and you can see instant um, performance increases every update. So, I do recommend this, you know, games like uh, DS games such as Brain Age or... Um, you know, some other uh, low graphic games run solid on quad core devices, and Pokemon and other uh, other games also run quite solid on quad core devices, like the newest quad core devices. Um, I do not recommend that you use a dual core or single core for this application just yet, uh, because you know it's not fully stable. Everything does work, but it's going to be way laggy on a dual core or single core whereas you're on a quad core. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is go into the Play Store and download Cool ROM, which is to download the Nintendo DS ROMs directly onto your device. And you know, you don't have to download this application, but it's quite useful just to get the ROMs directly from your phone. Alright, so once you have that, you can go and type in NDS for Droid. And you want to click the first one and install this application. Once you've installed both the applications from the Play Store, uh, the first thing you need to do is download the ROM. So you can just go to Cool ROM, and as you can see, I searched up Brain Age as my Nintendo DS ROM that I will be showing you guys. And you just go down and click Download Now. Once you have the ROM, go to your NDS4 Droid application. And let me exit that. Open it. The first time you open it, you will see all these folders. Um, actually, let me go into the directory. Okay, so you'll see all your folders, and if you've downloaded your ROM from Cool ROM, it's going to be saved in the Downloads folder. So if you download a ROM for Cool ROM, it's going to be in the Download folder. And I've actually transferred all my ROMs to a ROMs folder. And just locate your ROM and open the ROM from there. So I'm going to be opening Brain Age. As you can see, Brain Age runs quite well. Sound and everything works. could use the S Pen and cheat, but don't want to do that. Excuse me for my horrible drawing. Okay, want a kangaroo. Alright, so you guys get the point. Um, you can also uh, save and, you know, do everything your DS can do. Um, so it's quite nice, you know, like I said, it's quite an early version. There's a lot of updates from the developer that come in the Play Store, and you see instant improvements. Alright, so that's how you run DS uh, ROMs on your Android device, and if you need any if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments section, 
and please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.